hey guys welcome back to my channel i want to show you guys how i get these nice fluffy big curls using flexi rods this is my vip beauty hair this is what this is what it looks like after a long day of my curls and as you can see the ends are just not about it so i'm going to take my flat iron here and i'm just going to add a nice little bump specifically to the ends so that they can come out curly instead of being all straight and dull like how they were by the way this flat iron was from walmart it's a conair one i really don't like it but it gets the job done on to the flexies I use about 10 for this look I'm going to use four of the yellow ones and I put two on each side I believe these flexies are all the same sizes it's just in my mind I'm using two of the dark blue ones one on each side that's six and then I'm using four of the teal ones two on each side again that makes ten so what I'm also going to use is this argan oil and I'm just going to apply this all over my hair just to give it some shine to decrease the frizz, makes it make it nice and soft and I'm just going to apply that all over and then we're going to get to the application. Now I take the tail ones and I like to use the tail on the bottom. So as I told you I used two, I'm just going to part my hair and I'm just going to wrap the hair around the flexi while placing the flexi on top of the hair if that makes sense. I actually have plenty of flexi rod tutorials so go ahead and check those out like you know yeah. I actually have like a really instructional one but since you guys insisted here's another one. Now for the yellow ones I like to use those at the top of my hair and this is at the very beginning so I just wanted to put the yellow one up here and all I'm doing is the same method I'm just wrapping the hair around it and I'm making it super duper tight. For my little bang I'm using the dark blue one and some people like to pin curl this part but I noticed that with pin curls it don't give me the same flip so I like to use my flexi rod. And then I'm going to take my last yellow one and just add that to the remainder of the hair and that's how I apply my flexi rods I use the same color coordination on the on both sides I just want to show you how I did this side now that's what it looks like on to my bang honey what I like to do is just give it like a nice soft little bump for real because I'm going to pin curl it keep in mind I do take my wig off at night so the pin curl I just kind of place the pin on the hair instead of like digging it deep into the wig because it, it doesn't stick to anything and I use like two pins and that's what it looks like yes I'm rocking the flexies anyway so it is the next day and now you want to take your pin curls uh, pin curls your flexies out of your hair and you just unravel them and they come out looking like such girl look at that killing it and then once you take them out just go ahead and finger comb them some people like to use a paddle brush but I like for my curls to remain a little tight so I just finger comb them and I work with it I take my little bangs out yes Now since this is a full wig, you still can see the edge of my hair, so I'm going to go in with my edge control. This is the olive oil edge control, and I'm just going to slick down my edges just a little bit. And that is the final look. Again, this is my VIP beauty hair. I do have a review on this. Um, I have a lot of stuff on this, so just check the description box for all the links, but... This is how I get my big curls. Keep in mind, the more flexies, the more tighter, the more curly. So if you want this look, go for a lot of flexi rods. Anyways, thanks for viewing, guys. I'm Drugstore Queen Amy to all my new subbies. Hey, booze. And I will talk to y'all later. Bye, y'all.